So I got to tell you all about this. Today we're diving into a complete guide on how to record and stream directly from your ROG Ally. No external gear needed, just this awesome handheld and a hand cam for that immersive experience. Whether you're gaming, streaming, or just showcasing your setup, I've got you covered. Let's jump right in. First things first, let's make sure your ROG Ally is ready to go. Before we start recording or streaming, you want to ensure your settings are optimized for the best performance. Head over to your settings and tweak the display and performance settings for your game. If you're unsure what settings to use, don't worry, I'll show you a few tips and tricks. Now the ROG Ally comes with built-in tools that make this super easy, but we will be using OBS Studio to start recording directly from the device. Simply open OBS, hit start recording. Make sure to add a game recording source and a video capture source. I use Droid Cam, it's free, and an older Android phone to, as a camera to record my hand cam. No wires needed, just connect to your Wi-Fi and it's ready to go. Now of course I'm using the device at 30 watts plugged into power and CPU boost on. GPU settings are set to 8 GB and it works well. Now according to the game, you are playing. You might have to lower some in game graphics so it doesn't overload. As you can see, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 looks good and it's on medium settings with OBS we're running in the background. That's pretty amazing, not gonna lie. Next up is streaming. Whether you want to go live on Twitch, YouTube, or any other platform, the ROG Ally has you covered. Open up your OBS and configure your stream settings. Make sure to choose the right resolution and bit rate based on your internet connection. And all you have to do is hit start streaming button above the start recording button. Get everything set up, place your hand cam where you want it. This could be mounted on a stand or even held in place by a simple clamp. Once you're happy with the position, start your stream and you're good to go. Your audience will get to see not just the gameplay, but also your hands in action, adding a unique layer to your content. Before we wrap up, I want to share a few tips and common troubleshooting steps. If you notice any lag during streaming, try lowering your resolution or tweaking the performance settings. Note that the hand cam resolution doesn't have to be 720p. You can lower in-game graphics, play with the settings to see what you can accomplish. Now I did tie adding the record all scenes source plugin to record two different videos for B-roll ideas but that was too much stress on the APU. Let me know what you have done or your thoughts below. Leave a like. If you enjoyed this video, if I gave you an idea or if you are already doing this,
missing part. 